Israel pushes deeper into Gaza camps. 12 weeks into war, Israeli tanks push deeper into districts in central and southern Gaza overnight under heavy air and artillery fire, residents said, pressing a deadly offensive that has raised much of the enclave and that Israel has said may last months more. Fighting late on Friday and early Saturday was focused in Al Buraj, Nusirat, and Khan Yunis, backed by intensive airstrikes that filled hospitals with injured Palestinians. The bombardment has killed 100 Palestinians and injured 150 in the central Gaza Strip over the past 24 hours, a senior health official in central Gaza said. At Nasser Hospital in Khan Yunis, the biggest and most important medical facility in the south of the tiny crowded enclave, Red Crescent images posted online showed ambulances operating amid smashed streets, carrying injured children. Almost all of Gaza's 2.3 million residents have been forced from their homes by Israel's withering 12-week assault, triggered by the Hamas attack on October 7th that killed 1,200 people and brought 240 hostages into the group's grasp. The offensive has killed at least 21,500 Palestinians, according to health authorities in Hamas run Gaza, and the conflict risks spreading across the region, drawing in Iran-aligned groups in Lebanon, Iraq, Syria, and Yemen. Bombardment has smashed houses, apartment blocks, and businesses and put hospitals out of action. On Saturday, the Palestinian Culture Ministry said Israeli strikes had struck a medieval bathhouse. The old Great Mosque was hit earlier in the war, 